The Dodgers are now re-inviting drag group Sisters of Perpetual Indulgence to its Pride Night next month. Yes, this comes after a week of back and forth mm -hmm. full of controversy and backlash from both sides. People who wanted the group there and mm -hmm. those who did not. KCAL News reporter Leslie Marine is live at Dodger Stadium with the details. Leslie. Pat, yeah, the difference a few days makes, right? Well, I can tell you that not only will the Sisters of Perpetual Indulgence be on the field during Pride Night here at Dodger Stadium, but they will also be accepting the Community Hero Award, which is originally the reason they were invited. Dressed in Dodger blue in front of Dodger Stadium, Sister Beyonce knows is beaming with pride. I think uh, it's fair to say it's time for Dodger baseball, this time with nuns. But that excitement doesn't come without a hard learned lesson for the team she grew up watching. The Dodgers first uh, opened up and gave us uh, an apology and they acknowledged that they uh, rushed and made a rash decision. We felt as though their, apolog their apology was sincere. The Dodgers met with the Sisters of Perpetual Indulgence Monday. It was just a few days ago that the sisters were disinvited to Dodger Pride Night following backlash from Catholic organizations. Today, the Dodgers doing a 180, writing in a statement, we have asked the Sisters of Perpetual Indulgence to take their place on the field at our 10th annual LGBTQ plus Pride Night on June 16th. We are pleased to share that they have agreed to receive the gratitude of our collective communities for the life-saving work that they have done tirelessly for decades. One of the things we wanted to communicate to them was that a simple apology and re-invitation would simply not be enough. We, as well as the rest of our community, we want to ensure that this is genuine and that they are taking the right steps to reconfirm their allyship with us. The message that this instance should send to all organizations, athletic, corporate, or whomever, is the very lesson that the LA Dodgers tell us that they learned, and that is, look before you leap. The sisters say the Dodgers promised to seek counsel and education from several LGBTQ plus groups that were invited to today's meeting. But the sisters understand why not everyone will be jumping to accept this apology. Uh, but don't let go of your skepticism because, as we know from the 500 plus pieces of anti-trans, anti-drag legislation countrywide, this struggle for people to live and let live is not over. And there is a silver lining to all the controversy. In just a few days, the Sisters of Perpetual Indulgence have raised more than $15,000 in donations from supporters. All the money now going to other LGBTQ plus organizations in the LA area. It's insulting to be told you don't matter and the things that matter to you don't matter. For us, however, uh, unintentionally, the good senator and, uh, and unfortunately the Dodgers afforded us an opportunity to meet with you all and to sp tell people who we are. Well, if you remember when the Dodgers first announced this decision, many LGBTQ plus organizations decided that they would boycott the Dodgers Pride Night. We can tell you tonight the LA LGBT Center says it will now attend Pride Night. As for LA Pride, who helps the Dodgers put on the event, we have yet to hear if they will attend. Reporting live outside Dodger Stadium, Leslie Marine, KCAL News. Thanks.